hear the water running? That's a trip. I wonder where it's going. That's bizarre. Holy shit. That's freaky. Holy shit. Wow. I uh, used to live, believe it or not, by a Pfizer plant when I was at college in Terre Haute, Indiana. And uh, boy, talk about weird stuff going on around a building. I even wrote a book about it. And uh, anyway, uh, and then found out in later years that it really was probably nefarious, nefarious things, whatever going on there and uh one of my dogs the, the pfizer plant there we used to be rumor was it they made bombs there for the uh, last war or whatever and there was these big concrete pits out there and and they'd fill up with water and uh i lost my dog one night and i was calling him and uh i could hear him barking off in the distance so I followed the barking, much like I just did. <clears throat> and uh, I looked down in one of these pits, and there he was down there trying to, he was treading water. If I hadn't got there, God, 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 when I did, uh, I reached down with all, this dog was a 100-pound dog. This was a big dog. I grabbed a hold of his neck and just pulled him out. You know that super strength that parents get when they're trying to save a child? <clears throat> and looking at him later, his nails were just down to the nub and bleeding. He'd been treading against that concrete wall. He couldn't get, couldn't get out. Oh, it creeps me out to this day to even talk about it. Anyway, I got him out. Dogs, I guess, will fall into these pits. All this running through the water. And apparently they... Either the devil pushes them in or they run along and they don't see it and they just fall in. What I don't know. Anyway, it never happened again, thank God. Oh! So anyway, Mother Earth has stopped the rain for this walk. Thank you, Mother Earth. God, angels, whoever is involved in that kind of thing. Which she does quite often in my life. Pretty cool. All right, Cooper. Huh? What do you think? You want some cheese? Huh? Oh, no. Uh, can I do it? Can I do it? Sun got stuck. I, and this same thing happened to me. Exact same thing. It was wet, and we have a big hill that our driveway goes down a big hill, and it's gravel. And he was backing down with a trailer, and if you get off the edge, you're fucked. And he completely jackknifed the trailer, dented the rear end of the, our beautiful diesel truck, and I've been praying about it, and I'm hoping to God I can just get under there and push it and it pops right back out so he feels better because I know he feels horrible about it we just bought this truck or he did for hauling motorcycles 
big ass diesel, just killer, wonderful vehicle. It's great. Anyway, oh, it's starting to rain. Mother of sin, hurry up. Can't hold this back much longer. Uh, anyway, uh, I believe it's Sunday. Yes, it's Sunday. Guy came and bought a motorcycle from us yesterday. His friend leaned over and told us he had stage four cancer and he was, you know, buying a bike just to kind of have some fun, you know. And uh, I seen my video link, I, you know, or whatever. You never know. You never know. And uh, it's uh, the med beds are coming. I, I know we can heal ourselves, but we haven't. We've We've been so talked out of that, I, I don't see anybody doing that. But the med beds, you just really can't argue. Even if you don't believe in a med bed, you, it just takes longer for it to heal you. It will heal you no matter what. And they're coming to here, according to Sky, Sky Princess, I think. She said uh, next Saturday, they, it'd be Sunday, Australian time, but Saturday, at, I think it's like 7 o'clock at night. She's going to step into a med bed and they're going to film it. But she said it's a target date and it could subject to change, which, you know, you know what that means. But anyway, it could happen. Anyway, she's going to get at it and she wants to lose weight. She wants to have her knees, knees healed. She wants to be made younger and just general healing of everything that's wrong with her. And that's what med beds can do. And if you watch my videos, you'll know this. So, the rain stopped again. Thank you. Didn't want to kill my phone. Cooper, where are you at? Keepy. Coop. Cooper. Cooper. Anyway. Brandon, if you're watching, watch my videos, man. It's it's possible you're gonna make it through this because you're alive in a really spectacular time. They're gonna release these uh, at least by 2024, but I, they're they're here now, and people are getting in them, but it's, it's just not been made public because they're afraid of a stampede. Cooper, Cooper. There he is. Hey, little buddy. So anyway, more cheese. Ah, got stuck in my pocket. Uh, uh. There we go. Want a piece of cheese? As far as I can tell, it's all happening. I, you know, it's all happening. You know, even if you're an NPC, a non-playing character, uh, just a backdrop person going through life, just to fill in the back backdrop of, I believe, if you ask God, he'll 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 give you the spark, and you'll be more than just a backdrop person. The backdrop people, uh, what's her name, NPC, non-playing characters, uh, Dolores Cannon talks about them, and uh, just soulless, mindless bodies that fill up the background in our lives to add to the, the movie that we are going through. Uh, can't have a movie or a play without background characters right? but I also heard a, there's like over a million clones here and uh, uh, somebody said it's either the backdrop people or the backdrop people and the clones God's gonna have mercy on them and let them have a, a spirit 
And if you have a spirit, uh, God, you can get real close to God and listen and hear him. And you have your nine superpowers. I think it's in Colossians. Speaking in tongues, speaking in tongues with interpretation, prophecy, discerning of spirits. Was it faith, miracles, healing, word of knowledge, word of wisdom? Nine superpowers you have once you bully Romans 10, 9, and 10. And not only have your spirit, but get it activated. Romans 10, 9, and 10. It says, Thou shalt be saved, and that means you got it. So, anyway, it's all happening. Hang in there. Bye.